Here's how to automatically book meetings with your new web form leads using Copper. First, you'll need to create your web booking link. If you're using Google Calendar, you can head into your calendar, hit the Create button in the upper left, and this will allow you to create a new appointment scheduler link. Fill in all of the information with your preferred meeting times and save your new booking link. Once you've saved your booking link, you'll be able to actually access the link that you can share with customers to book times directly into your calendar. Copy this link, and we're going to put this link into your Copper profile. Once you're in Copper, click your icon in the upper left of your Copper account. Here you'll find a new field called booking link. This is where you can paste in the booking link that you've created. You can also use Calendly or any preferred booking link that you have from your appointment scheduler. Once you've created and linked your booking link to Copper, the next thing we'll need to do is understand how your new web form leads are being created in Copper. Head over to the form section and you can see here in my example, for each new web form submission, I'm creating a new lead with the lead status of new and the lead source of web form submission. Now that I know how my new leads are created, next we'll need, we'll need to create a filter. I've headed over to my lead section and I've created a filter here for the activity type form, status of new, and web form submission. I've saved this filter as new web form leads to capture all of my new web form leads. Next, we'll need to create the email automation. Head over to automations in your copper and because we're using email automation, we'll select email automation. And then we can hit create new. And since my form is set up to generate leads, we'll create a new lead automation. Here's an example of how I've set up my email automation. I'm sending the automation to everyone who enters new web form leads filter. I've set it to only add new contacts that are added to the list so any current contacts won't create the won't receive the email that I've just created. I can see that I've also set up the email automation so the email comes from the lead owner. This way as I update my form settings and my owners in copper, I don't need to update the email automation. Now when you're crafting your email, you can either create the template in advance or create it in the email automation window. And where you want to add in the booking link, you'll need to select merge fields, scroll to the bottom, and here you'll find the merge field for booking link. This will place in the booking link that you have created in your copper. Next, all we need to do is hit save. Now all of the new web form leads that come into my copper will automatically be sent my email. Once they click that booking link, copper will automatically mark them as replied and they'll be removed from my email sequence if I have multiple steps. There you go. You've now automated your email to new web form lead submissions. Here's how to automatically